hello friends welcome to another video on my youtube channel and in today's video you will learn to build this kind of beautiful interface where you provide some credential i drop a pdf file and with the help of this credential it will create knowledge out of this pdf file and in the down section of this page you will have a chat interface where you can interact with the pdf file through a kind of a chatbot interface so let's get started before we move forward i would like to say that i'm using a framework called gradio to build this kind of beautiful interface and gradio is a wonderful tool and you can use it for all of your machine learning project demos next uh, we are using pinecone so if you don't have account with pinecone you should create account with pinecone with your uh, email id or google credentials and uh, from the api key section you need to get environment and uh, api key value once you have that uh, we can you know move forward to the code section so here i am inside my visual studio code and uh, yeah let me clear the things so we have three things index.py uh, gradio ui and conversation and before you run any of the file you need to create a virtual environment and install all the required uh, dependencies from this requirements.txt file so the first thing is index.py this file will create indexes on uh, pinecone uh, infrastructure so what i'm doing here is i'm reading a pdf file uh, then creating a txt file then loading the txt file creating a documents then with the help of text splitter i'm splitting the document into smaller pieces and then using open ai embeddings and pinecone i'll create embeddings and store the embeddings on pinecone then i have this conversation pi here i'm creating a conversational retrieval chain uh, for that i'll initialize pinecone uh, embedding and db this db will read the indexes from pinecone i'm creating a memory and then conversational retrieval chain and you know query the conversational retrieval chain get the response and you know send it back to the user so this is the conversation part then the third part is gradio ui so it is not possible for me to explain every part of this gradio ui in this video but i have other videos in which i have explained some basic components of gradio so we are creating blocks a row uh, which takes the credentials uh, this part first part then there is another row uh, which has uh, two columns for the one is file and the second is to upload button and index clear button and then there is a chatbot message and clear button so there is a chatbot message and clear button so when user uploads a document what i do is i call uh, create index uh, function from this indexes and create indexes uh, when someone clicks on this clear index i'll uh, clear the index and when someone submits the message i call the uh, create conversation i provide message and chatbot and other credential and receive message and chatbot and that will be rendered here so let's look into the working for that i need pinecone api key a pinecone environment index name and open ai api key so i'll get my environment i'll get my api key then let's say my index name is test index make sure you don't use any special character or space in between the name of the index and finally let me paste my open ai api key okay now i have provided all the credential i can now upload a pdf file uh, let's say let me use this conda cheat sheet 
and then i'll hit upload so this will first create a test index on pinecone and then store all the embeddings on this test index so let me go to pinecone and let me go to indexes uh, let me refresh this i think uh, this is going to take time yeah so test indexes are created and being initialized let me go into that let's see here yeah it is still it i'm i i am not sure but it will take a minute or two depending on the document size and your internet speed yeah let me refresh this one more time yeah it's still taking time yeah you can see it is now green that means index is ready and if i refresh one more time hopefully we will see some vectors here yeah now there are five vectors so uh, yeah and you can see that document uploaded and index uh, created successfully you can chat now so now i can say hi yeah since the document was uh, about conda so i'll say like how to create a new environment environment yeah i guess it is working i guess it is working you can see it has created you know kind of a good response from the small pdf file so yeah so i guess this is it from this part of the video uh, i hope you have gained some knowledge and you have now acquired the things to build you know this kind of beautiful interface one more thing that in case you want to share this with anybody you can always uh, create angiroc public url using angiroc http 7860 since uh, this application is running on 7860 port so i'll say angiroc http 7860 and i'll hit enter this will create this public url and when i click on it i can see the same beautiful interface so i hope uh, you have gained some knowledge out of this video and in case you do so please consider subscribing to my channel that helps thank you for watching peace